Hey everybody, it's me again. Um, so recently on one of my videos, the party outfit video, I got a request to do um, a dress haul. And I'd like to thank who, I can't remember the name exactly, but whoever asked that, thank you so much because that was a really good idea. I'm actually, it's really fun to do. Um, I didn't realize how many dresses I had until I pulled them out of my closet. Um, I apologize in advance, my room isn't set up the best for this. Like I don't have anywhere to sit them beside me to pull up and show you. So I'm gonna have to be like in and out of the shot, walking back and forth, so in advance I apologize. Uh, my room just is not set up the best for that. Um, so, without further ado, let's get started because I really don't like long intros. Um, the first dress was not hung up, so it's the easiest to show you. It's just, um, it's black and pink, like that. And it's just really tight and really short, my MO. Um, it's made out of this, like, stretchy material. Um, hold on, I can actually probably tell you. It's, um... It's like polyester and spandex, so it's just very hugging to your shape, which I like. Okay. Oh, almost dropped it. I'll just leave that in there anyway. Um, I got this dress. It's from BB. The back is open. That's why it looks weird. Um, it's strapless and it's really short, and it's not the light. The cameras are picking it up right, but it's kind of like um, a reptile-ish material, but not in a trashy way. Um, it's strapless and it's just like right there over the boobs. And it's very, very, very short. So I don't wear this out unless it's to a party where I really know people. And I have my girls with me, so I don't have to worry about anything like riding up or anything. Because this is just very short. But it was on sale and I had to get it. I love the way it just hugs my hugs me. So um, this next dress is also from BB. It's um like this, and it zips in the front. And I am in love with this. This might be might be my favorite dress. It looks so pretty on. Um, and it just sits up in the front and it's strapped and it just you can kind of see it has a curve shape to it already, even on the rack. So you know it's gonna give you more curves than you may necessarily have. So there's that one. Sorry, I had to change my song. Okay. Again, this is from BB, and I'm not bringing for this to be like a BB haul. I think this is the only other dress I have from BB, but I really like that dress for some reason. So, it's just a bodycon dress. It's just, just you slip it on, and it's really tight. All my dresses are tight. I sound like a whore. But, um, and it's pretty short, but not so short that I have to worry about it. I like wearing, um, like nude stockings with this, because it makes my legs look really tan, and just black heels, because of the black in the skirt. And, like, um, Big chunky jewelry because it's such a simple dress. That's just my opinion, you know, whatever. And this is not a dress, but I felt like I had to show it anyway because I wear it all the time. I mean, all the time. It's this skirt from Wet Seal, and I love ruffles. I I just I, I did not think I would, but I love tiered skirts and ruffly shirts, and I just love them. Um, yeah, so it's just a skirt, and it's not really a dress, but I love it, so I thought I should show you guys a look. Next up is this dress from, I think, Hot Topic, and I don't usually shop there for dresses, because I never really like their dresses. That's not really my taste. I'm not downing it. It's just not what I like to wear, um, but it's super pretty. It zips up in the back, and it's like, it sits up better, but... It's like that, and on the bottom it has like this little black lace, if I can try the camera to pick it up. And it's got like polka dot lace on it, and it's a light pink color. And anyone who knows me knows I love pink, as you can tell by my room. Maybe one day I'll show you the rest of my room, but it's kind of messy right now. But I love pink. Always have. From childhood to now, I've loved pink. This next dress I am in L O V E with. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. It's from American Eagle. And it's called like the ballerina party dress, which sounds corny, but it's got this crocheted lace kind of top thing going on, if you can see that. And it has this button closure, which really isn't there, but it's just there for looks. So it's built in, but it looks like it's there. And it has this tool bottom, and it just is so summery cute and so Taylor Swifty. I wore this out, and my friends called me Nyla Swift. It was. It was cute looking back on it. I, I didn't like it at the time, but looking back on it, they were just being nice. They were being, not nice, but teasing me in a loving way. But yes, I love, love, love this dress. I love the Empire. I think it's the Empire waist. I'm not sure. I haven't been a girl that long. But, um, yeah. This next dress, I honestly 
And I probably should start talking when I get over here because you probably can't hear me over there, huh? I will get better at this YouTube thing, guys. Um, I haven't worn this yet, which is a shame because I really like it. And I bought a pair of shoes just to match it. Um, it's like, it zips again in the front. If you can't tell, I love the zippered front. And these ribbons attach to these eyelets. Um, I think that's what they're called. Something like that. And it has, it's crocheted in the back. Like that ruched, ruched, I don't know, ruched, ruched, I, I, whatever. But I just like the color scheme, the black and nude type feel. It's just, I like it. And it's pretty padded. So that helps girls like me, if you know what I mean? Like, little boobs. This last dress was actually a gift from my sister. And I thank her so much if she happens to watch this. I don't know if she does or not. I don't think she does. I told, I don't know. I told people who know me personally, Andrew Olvera, not to watch these. But I guess you can be the exception because I know you're probably going to watch it. If you even watch it to this point, because you know how boys are. They don't want to see dresses and stuff. But I, I might tell him to watch it just so he can see the shout out. Everybody should check out the Andrew Olvera channel. He's really, really funny and a super nice guy. So... And, but anyway, back to the dress. It's blue on top and black. And it's very, it's more classy than some of the other dresses I have. Like I wore this for like Thanksgiving dinner or whatever. And it looks really pretty on. And I'm really self-conscious about my shoulders. So I really usually don't like dresses like this. Like they don't, okay. I'm trying to think how I can explain myself because all my dresses show my shoulders. But if a dress is shorter, I feel like it attracts the eyes to the legs. Whereas this one, it's not long by any means, but it's right above the knee. Like it's a longer skirt for me. But it's very pretty on. I fell in love with it with my black heels. And the materials are really, really soft, very comfortable, and it folds here just so beautifully. So there's that dress. So that is pretty much all of my dresses. And I apologize if this is a long video. Um, again, it was requested, and I thought it would be a really fun thing to do. And it really was. Like, looking at my dresses, I'm so proud of myself because, I mean, I think I have good taste personally but um something else I just recently got and I, if anyone else knows about these um let me know because I don't know if I'm using them right like I don't know but they're these um NYX jumbo eyeshadow pencils um I got the purple ones because I really like purple it's like a light purple and a dark purple maybe if I take these off you can see like that and I did the light purple on my lid and then the darker purple in the crease and then I tried to use my blending brush to fade it and it didn't work out that well but again practice makes perfect um I'm good with my naked palette so far. I've done, I've gotten a lot much, a lot better with it. Um, I'm trying to think there's anything else while I'm already rambling on. Um, I like looking around. Um, nope, that's really it. Um, so I hope everyone enjoys this video. And again, I apologize for like the crappy audio. I didn't realize that I was walking over there and talking and then just trailing that in. It, uh, I'm sorry. Well, I hope to see you guys soon. Oh, by the way, the question and answer thing, I did get some questions, and I will be answering those in the, probably my next video. Um, oh, and real, real quick, I'm sorry, this is getting kind of long. I'm sorry. Um, thank you so much for anyone who subscribed to my channel. It means a lot that people are listening. Um, I personally don't really care how many subscribers I get. Um, I like, as long as I'm helping someone, and I have gotten messages from other trans girls, and that, it means a lot. But it is very flattering to have that many people listening to you or to know that, you know, they're listening. And it does. It means a whole lot. So thank you everyone so much. And I hope you keep watching. Um, big things might be coming up. I'll leave you with a little teaser there. So I hope everyone's having a great week. And I'll talk to you guys soon.